Okay, hello Juba people. Welcome to my first tutorial. Uh, so I uploaded Till It Happens to You by Corrine Bailey Ray uh, last week, I think. And because I'm a genius, I didn't have my hands or the guitar in the shot. So you guys can listen to it and it's linked below, but uh, you can't see the chords. So <laughs> I'm going to teach you the chords now. <laughs> okay, so the song is a little bit complicated. It's pretty much intermediate guitar, all right, but gorgeous, beautiful chords, love it. Um, it has basically four big sections, okay, or four like distinct sections. So the first little part is pretty simple. Um, what I'm gonna do is just play through it so you can hear, kind of, and then uh, I'll zoom you in and, and we'll look at the chords, okay? Can you see? <laughs> All right, so we start here with C sharp minor and then G sharp minor seven, and that's um, I, I know what I said was heat up the moment. There's a little truth in. to slightly different chords because um, I don't know call this the pre-chorus what I don't oh what I don't know anymore that was the pre-chorus and then it goes to the chorus used to feel like it another section so you play that whole section again and then she does this whole like build up of the chorus okay so it's the whole da, 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 till it happens to you and then it's um uh, no one believes uh, tell the truth little sections again if you want to watch the whole thing then the cover is linked below let me zoom you in this way hello <laughs> uh, is that too close I think maybe it's easier if you can see the neck yeah okay so here's my first fret so the first chord is C sharp minor which is bar okay finger one two three four obviously um first finger on the fourth fret <laughs> and then second finger on the second string from the bottom fifth fret third finger on the fourth string from the bottom like that just a c sharp minor i'll try to link the pdf as well okay so that's the only part that we're picking we do that twice can you see i'm just going from the top and then this count is a little bit weird okay but let me show you the chords first it's just a G sharp minor so all your fingers are in the same fret fourth fret 
finger one on the E string, finger two on D, finger three on every angry dog growls G, <laughs> finger four on B, okay? Alright, that's the chord. Ooh, don't play the don't play the high E. And then we just slide it back. Two, three. Okay? It goes third fret, fourth fret, third fret, second fret. Okay? <laughs> Let's look at that count, the, the rhythm of it. So it goes one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, six. C sharp minor. G sharp minor seventh. Four, five, six, one. Okay? So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay? Um, again, you can you can watch the cover to like play along. Okay, then we're here with um, that's we're going to be nine. So we've gone and then we put second finger on A, first finger on D. That's B9. And then again. This chord, which is a, <laughs> a little bit confusing, C diminished seven. Okay, finger one, fret two, the second fret, third string from the bottom, second finger, third fret on A, third finger, fourth fret on D, <laughs> fourth finger, fourth fret on B. Can you see that? Come closer, like that. Okay. Um, so we came from here. Nah. And then it's C sharp minor again. I don't know. Back to C diminished. C diminished seven. What? I don't know. This is an E6 of a B. Okay, so it looks like E, just a normal E. And then you add your little finger on your B string, second fret. Like that. I don't know. And then we have. <laughs> Uh, this is an F sharp nine of A sharp. Okay, it's a little bit confusing. This one goes here, and then here, first fret. And then third finger is fourth string, second fret. First finger, B string, second fret. Okay, it kind of looks like a zigzag. Okay, that's the hard stuff done. Now it's easy. We're playing an A, just normal A. And then move it up two frets to the fourth fret. And then this A, which is fifth fret B string, sixth fret uh, G, seventh fret A. Ah, uh, sorry, D. Let's do that again. So starts on fret one, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> uh, second finger on the third string from the top. First finger on the third string from the top. Second finger on the A string. Third finger on every angry dog growls. G string. <laughs> G string, sorry. Um, hope you can see that nicely. Seventh, and then we take our second finger off, and we 
then move everything back to frets to make an A6 over here. And then we go back to E major 7. Just play it better than I did. And back to frets. Okay. Nobody wants F sharp minor. Okay, so that's this chord. One, two, three, four. Remember from this stuff? But you're on the second fret. Nobody wants to face the truth. Then we have an F major seven. So we go to the first fret. Finger one on E. Finger two on B. Finger three, second fret on D. Finger four, second fret on. G. <laughs> like that. That's an F major seventh. Okay. Should we do the chorus again? start from the beginning everything we've done so we got the verse um, that was the verse and then the pre-chorus again I don't know what remember the E6 with a little finger on B I don't know and then F sharp 9 A sharp the zigzag chord like that anymore E sorry that's A again used to feel like heaven used to feel like me da -da 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 -da. string of like a symphony now they've gone away so it's all the same for the second verse and then it's nobody wants to face the truth Don't you dare tell them back down again what you think you have to do till they get over. Okay, so that's G sharp minus seventh, and then uh, what is this called? Da -da 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 -da. F sharp minus seventh. Learn these things. Okay, so there's a lot of chords there. There is one, two, three, four, five, ten, fifteen, sixteen chords. <laughs> okay, but like these ones all look the same. 
This one is a B9, which is quite a familiar jazz chord. Okay, and then C sharp minor, G sharp minor. All right, um, I think that's everything. I hope so. I'm gonna watch this back and then be disappointed in myself because I probably forgot something. Uh, okay, again, I'm just gonna be back out because this is scary. All right, I'm sorry that I didn't have my guitar in the shot for the cover. I hope you guys watch the cover. It's easier to like um, play along with that one. And then also, obviously, Corinne has beautiful, beautiful recordings of that song on YouTube. So yeah, that's Till It Happens To You. Again, quite quite a like intermediate level song, um, but so much fun to play once you once you've got it down. So hope you guys enjoy. I will see you in the next video.